I used a weird camera filter and a fantastic vintage lens to create strange infrared landscapes. Mallorca was a perfect place to experiment with this infrared filter. Because the island is in the middle of the Mediterranean Sea, there's a lot of sunlight and a very strong infrared exposition. I made a first video explaining how my digital camera was modified to full spectrum by color revision. If you didn't watch the first episode, there's a link in the description. Most infrared filters need some post-treatment in Photoshop to see the final look of your image. With this filter, when you see your photo in camera, this is what you get. It's pretty disappointing. But the magic happens in Photoshop when you apply a channel swap to the image. I used the filter with a fantastic vintage lens that is perfect for infrared photography. Many vintage lenses have a problem of color pollution when you use them for infrared, but not this one. Here are the photos I shot during my trip in the wild natural parks of Mallorca. The K's orange filter is a pretty amazing filter that offers some stunning results when you use it for epic landscapes. Modifying a camera to full spectrum can be expensive, so if you don't have a camera you want to modify or just don't have the budget for it, 
I created the infrared LUT that can recreate the look of the higher chrome filter on any video footage and even on photos. Check the link in the description to get it. And if you want to know more about how to convert your camera to infrared, check these videos.